hi there welcome back to the next video and in this video i will explain what we discussed in the previous video which is the explanation of set operators so if you remember in the previous video i talked about the plus minus intersection and the symmetric difference set operators which are uh, which you can use for achieving the uh, complex scenarios or the complex business rules that uh, that is like every day's reality okay so how we can do that let's first of all go into the edit and we will use this sum of sales for keeping the explanation simple as we are just starting and uh, one of the very first thing that we discussed is the one minus dollar and then your field name which is sales so what it was is basically one if you remember from my previous videos it means the entire data set minus dollar that means the current selection so let's go ahead and come over here in the expression editor and open the curly brackets and in that write one minus dollar and uh, now see it in action click apply right now zero because uh, uh, dollar indicates uh, the current selection and if nothing is selected that means the entire selection and one indicates the entire data so one minus right now dollar it basically indicates one the entire data so let's click on done for now and if you see if we select anything the value will change so for example furniture that means from the entire uh, data the furniture have been excluded and what it represents the value for office supplies and technology in this case and if i just select technology then 3.75 million is basically the office supplies so similarly if you have more filters like this and if you want to achieve this kind of an outcome where you want to exclude the selections that you are making from the entire data then you can use one minus dollar like this which i have used it over here so it's a uh, very very tricky uh, and uh, sometimes uh, it has been used along with the value which is showing uh, the value related to the selection and then what is not related to the selection if you want to show we can always uh, you know utilize this this kind of an operation which is related to the set operators now as an assignment if you have followed my previous video we have created a bookmark and in the previous video i have shown you that how you can use the intersection which is a star operator and then basically get the common records between the bookmark value in the and the current selection value and uh, yeah you can take it as a as a uh, homework for yourself and uh, do an experiment with that and that will help you learn the set operators so that's pretty much it i have for you in this video and in the next video we i will extend my conversation to show you a little bit more about the set operators